516 turn into the forecast. Yeah. A little better than yesterday, Matthew. Definitely going to be better than Good. yesterday. We might just have to wait until we get into the second half of the morning and then into the, into the afternoon hours before we really get to reap the benefits of what should be a very nice, comfortable day. Outside, though, right now, you can still see on the roadway on our neighborhood network up in Bethlehem a sheen there on the road because we did have, of course, the rain that came down yesterday in the afternoon and into the evening as well, and it was a heavy rain. Really, depending on where you were, it was heavier in some places than others. And you take a look at some of our totals that we got yesterday. Heaviest as you head further south and east from the city. So up in the Lehigh Valley, again, while we did have plenty of rain, it was not some of the heaviest that we saw across the area. Mays Landing came in just shy of two inches of rain yesterday. Dover down in Delaware, just about an inch and three quarters. Philly, we got just about a half an inch of rain. So again, overall, the heaviest rain did fall south and east of the city, which is what we were thinking would happen. And uh, again, right now we're also watching as Nestor was Nestor continues to travel away from the Delaware Valley away from the mid Atlantic, but our next weather maker already spiraling out here in the Midwest thunderstorm activity firing up some severe thunderstorms even from St. Louis through Little Rock back down of course towards the Dallas area where we had those tornadoes last night and it really is going to be a day tomorrow where we get our fair share of some rainy weather because that front will pass through our region here on Tuesday. So high pressure for the most part is in control today, but it is generally an unsettled pattern because here comes our front. Tuesday in the second half of the afternoon, the evening, and then the overnight, especially that will be our time frame for the heaviest rain. And then as we get then into Wednesday, it gets breezy and it gets cooler as high pressure starts to filter in generally to the south. But again, that will bring some cooler air with it, and it will definitely be a breezy middle of the week. When it comes to the heaviest rain amounts, then throughout the day tomorrow, while it was south and east of the city on Sunday, it looks like the heaviest rain will stay north and west on Tuesday, where we could be looking at some spots once again up near an inch or so of rain before before the system is all said and done. 67 degrees for our high today, though. Afternoon sunshine for us. Again, a couple of clouds will thin out through the morning hour. 66 then tomorrow with the rain. Cooler, breezy, and 63 on Wednesday. And then 67 Thursday. Chandler, we get a couple more showers there through the end of the week, too. But overall, pretty fall-like pattern in store all week long for even the next seven days.